Most narcissists, they're charming. That's like one of the big um, characteristics of a narcissist, right? Um, I want to hear from you, what did the charm look like? So for example, for me, you know, we joked about it earlier, is the poems. I received a poem every other day. There was, I stopped at the stoplight and I thought about you and I wrote this poem on the spot and this was it. Um, he was also, he was very charismatic um, and very supportive. That was, to me, it was just very charming to be overly supportive and to purchase all types of gifts for me. When I knew that financially he wasn't in a place to do that, but there were so many gifts. So who wants to kind of touch bases on that? So he came at me, you know, really seeming like he was generally that kind of man that you would want be in your children's lives. And so I was like, okay, you know, that, this is great. You know, a real man who wants to be around, is interested in, in not just me, but know that we are a package deal. So that was very, that's, that's how he came with me too. Just like a man, you know, people were always attracted to him. And um, he was all, always at my house fixing things. What do you need? You need this, you need that, you know, mm -hmm. just to fix it. And he was just there. Like, he knew I didn't drink beer, so he would pick out his beer, and he would pick out a lighter beer for me. He knew where we were gonna go get our sandwiches and then we'll go on a five and a half hour canoe trip. Wow. And then we'll come back and then he'll pay for dinner and then he'll know where we're gonna go dancing and where we're gonna go have to drink and then like it was just like everything was so too good to be true. Yeah, and like you know, we didn't go to a regular movie, we had to go to the IPIC. Like everything was he just he spoils you that way. Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah, like but it was three, four or five times a week and he's very like he's gonna make you feel special because he's very affectionate so he's also affectionate to you and spoiling you and yeah it was he was very charming in that way yeah. for each one of the women there was he, he seemed to know really how to make you feel special you know and narcissists are really good at that because they're paying a lot of attention and collecting a lot of data so they're listening they're listening to gather information, mm -hmm. which is different than listening out of care. Yes. It's I'll gathering watch. data. And so when they come back and yeah, you're, you have sons, well, he's gotten all the data, mm -hmm. right? So of course, the wooing is tailored to you. Mm -hmm.